Hey guys, Beautiful Esky here. I just wanted to do this dog haul real fast. I've gotten quite a bit of stuff for my dogs. And um, honestly, there's a couple things in here that I've already kind of used. <laughs> so um, don't mind the fur if you see some fur in a brush. But yeah guys, so um, first up, I actually got this today in the mail. And I've got another pet teaser too that I'll show you here in a second. Let's see if I can get that to focus on that. It's called the Pet Teaser De-Shedding and Grooming Brush. It's for heavy shedding and long haired dogs. I live in the USA and this is actually only in the UK right now. So I'm very, very, very excited to try this. The one that I have is the one for more thinner um, hair and stuff, but it still works for my dogs too. So, but this is more for getting that double coat and de-shedding them. Um, but I'll show you guys the other one too in just a second along with this one as well. But this one's purple and the other one I believe is like a pink and yellow. And it was, now this, I bought it off eBay and I believe it was 30 bucks, I believe. And gosh, it took forever. It took like a month to get to me. That one did. But the other one only took two weeks. All right, next up, I bought this <laughs> fresh breath. They've already got some um, toothpaste and toothbrushes, but um, I've seen this at PetSmart. And I believe it was $18, $18.99. And this toothbrush really looks cool. So I thought it'd be awesome. And then I like the little finger um, brush in there as well. And it's Advanced Whitening Kit, Oral Care Kit for Dogs. Removes plaque and tartar with 3D Micro Guard. And honestly, I probably won't use that in the water, just to be honest, perfectly honest. Um, you know, not saying, you know, I just, I personally won't, but I say it's great for your pup if you, uh, need to do that. All right. Also here, sorry guys, if I'm hitting into the camera, <laughs> I got this D matting rake and it's by Conair and it's got a nice soft little grip. And um, it helps safely detangle coat and minimize shedding. Penetrates deep into coat with gentle curved design. And it says top paw. And let me see here. It was $17.99. And steel. Now Chinook. Chinook has no problem with mats or tangles. It's steel. My woolly husky. <laughs> so I really honestly don't have to use this on Chinook, um, he's never really had a knot or a tangle in his life. <laughs> and then I got this flea comb, and it's not because <laughs> they don't have fleas. Um, it's honestly because still he'll get mats around um, his ears. His The back of his ears likes to try and mat for whatever reason. No idea why. They just always have. So this makes sure to brush it through evenly and tight enough to get all the little mats and tangles out. And it's by Conair as well. And of course helps remove fleas it says. And it's stainless steel, precision, angled teeth. But honestly that is why I got it to be more precise with the coat. And it's got a soft um, handle as well. And the flea comb was $12.99. And I got this Chi for Dogs Detangling Finishing Spray. If you guys follow me on Instagram, come on over. Follow me on Instagram because I make a lot of little side videos too of like my dogs and things and what I use to brush them out. So everybody knows that follows me anyway on Instagram that uh, I use the um, Mane and Tail Detangler, which it's great. Amazing. I love it. And I also like to use Cowboy Magic on them as well like the kind of looks like it almost like a frizzies but I wanted to try this since it was like for dogs especially but the other stuff is safe to use on dogs I have checked believe me I never would do that <laughs> I always check first to make sure it's safe to use on dogs and it should say on the back of anything 
like for dogs, you know, ponies, you know, everything else, so. But yeah, I thought she would be awesome to try. I've heard a lot of people talking about this, that it's really good, so I wanted to try it. And also, the Chi Detangling Spray, $11.99, so not bad, and it's a pretty good size bottle. And two, I'm sorry, the dogs have already been chewing on these, and I'm sure you guys would not like to see that anyway, but I got on these bones, Nala Bone. Um, this one's an antler alternative Nala Bone, and then this one's just kind of a beef flavored Nala Bone. It's kind of like, looks that color, honestly. And they were, I can find one. Okay, the antler, believe it or not, was $22.99. And then the other one was $16.99. And I always, I always get the extreme. Of course, I tore that part of the package off down there. But it was on like that, like the extreme chewing right here. Let me see if I can get it to focus. It'll show on the bottom because, oh my gosh, my boys are extreme chewers. Also, I got this uh, documentary in the mail today. It's called Pit Fooled. I really, really, really recommend anybody that is into um, wanting to know what to feed their pet and to feed them better. I definitely, definitely recommend this documentary. I found it on eBay. And I believe it was 10 It was $10 or something like that. Also, too, I got um, two of these tie outs. I do not recommend you to leave your dog unattended on a tie out. I just, I just don't. I got two of them though separately for Steel and Chinook if I'm out there with them. If I'm out there sitting with them and if they, you know, don't want to be right next to me and kind of walk around they can do so. And I would never, I don't advise leaving your dog on a stake by itself. And I also got two of these as well and it's up to 90 pounds and it's 25 foot long tie out large I believe this was ten dollars I believe so and I think this was around five possibly but this is up to 90 pounds I know they don't weigh that but I like I don't I don't know the other cables just looked a little thin for me and these were definitely a thicker cable so you know, if you think your dog would do better on something a little thicker, it, even if they're not in that weight, right? You know, go ahead, go for it. You know. And also, I got now. I'm sure you're gonna be like, now, why in the world do you have these silicone things? Well, to be honest, um, when I give them a bath, I mean, super soft. You could, I could rub this on my face all day and it not hurt. At all these are super soft I was thinking of like using um this when I give them a bath just kind of on their face kind of give them a little face massage especially this one now this one's really soft too but I really like this one the best um, and that I just no, I wouldn't use that side at all definitely this side and both of this one sides is good to use too but yeah definitely use those and to think here. Oh yeah, so <laughs> I finally invested in a dryer. Let me go get it actually. Sorry, might be a pause here for a second, but be right back. stuff here. <laughs> okay, you know what? Instead of lugging it in and rolling it in, that'll be another video. <laughs> but anyways, okay, so I got the Air Force Master Blaster and um, it's an 8 horsepower dryer by Air Force Commander. And it's really, really nice. And I've seen other people using it on their Huskies as well. And 
they come with all of this um it actually came with like a free door mount if you like want to hang it on a door or possibly a strong enough fence and then you can blow dry them that way and then too it came with all of these nozzles um honestly though i probably either will just use it the way like the way the hose is there's just you know there how there's the hose probably just use that alone without an attachment or I think definitely this one will be my go-to to use and then this one just like for a fluff up or I'm blowing out their coat and then here's the other attachments I mean you know not really much different that one's you know more for a drying but I don't know I don't know if I'd use that one or not I really like these other ones to dry them with and then of course here's like the little thing that like tightens it onto the hose and then here's another teeny tiny thing I I would not recommend that <laughs> maybe if you're drying a car <laughs> but yeah guys I believe that is it I mean if if anybody wants to know this was three hundred and sixty five dollars uh, oh but it's a great investment I'm, I'm definitely happy because it's good for blowing out their coat it's just not like for bathing them it is for that too but also helps blow out their coat everything helps get that loosened out under there also Let's add on another 150 bucks, right? Had an electrician come out and make a spot where this could just be ran on one um, outlet, like one place, and it's actually only got one spot. You know how outlets have two? Usually this one only has one outlet, and it's specifically for this dryer, and nothing more can be run while I'm running the dryer. So that's great. It's like 18 amps. I believe I mean you know it could be ran on a 20 amp but thankfully he went ahead and did a 25 amp you know just to make sure and um, it's like I think the voltage is like 120 V I believe volt and yeah if anybody's interested um, I got it off eBay Air Force Commander Master Blaster can't wait to use it on my boys. I actually was hoping to uh, use it this week, but kind of a little out of commission. <laughs> Sadly, had ingrown toenail surgery, and it's been rough. I've got two more things, and then I'm done. <laughs> had almost forgot I was about to end the video here <laughs> honestly had almost forgotten these other two brushes um, okay here's the pet teaser we got today and then here's the pet teaser I've had for a little bit and it came from the UK as well and it's a detangling and dog grooming brush for light shedding wiry and fine haired dogs and here it is yep still a little hair <laughs> forgive me but I mean it's so nice and it works so well and even though it says it's for fine hair dogs like it's so nice and here I'll go ahead and open this one too because this one's bristles does have a little more give this one than this one I think see I mean I know I can still bend those but I don't know they just seem thicker to me on that one than this one but it's held up great so I can't wait and it's really cute like they have um, I don't know if you can see it probably not like there's like little dogs and bones outline you can really see it on the purple there you go and then it says pet teaser super cute brush and then last but certainly not least I got this pet angel brush you also can see that on my Instagram was still enjoying it and just loving that and um, this one is heat resistant anti-static and 
antimicrobial. And then also, I believe with the pet teaser, you can use it wet. But now it says not to get it. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Not to get it hot. So you definitely wouldn't want to be brushing your dogs with it and running like a hot dryer. But now I think this one you could test it on humans. Hilarious. And still loved it. So if you go on my Instagram, you can see a little steel. Oh, also on here too. Yeah, I mean, I forgot I posted on here too. I'm sure if you go down below this video or the next one, you'll see he still loves the pet angel and he just keeps putting his little paw on me, want me to brush him more. All right, guys. I'm trying to think before I end this because I know it's been a little bit. Yeah, I showed you pet pool. Um, I do believe that is all of my dog haul. Yep. Yep, I do believe so. Alright guys, I'm so excited to see how this Chi does, to be honest. And also the rake and the brushes, all of them. I can't wait to see if this like really desheds because... You know, the de-shedding brushes I have, like Furminator, and then I have like a rake, I only use that maybe every 30 days because you don't want to give your pup brush burn. And uh, this, it says you can use on your pet every day. You can use forwards or backwards, but of course you want to go with the hair, I suggest. But maybe if there's a knot or a tangle and you just kind of need to get up under there, sure, I can see that. But I definitely would go with the fur, the way the fur goes. And, um... So hopefully with that, because I mean, that'd be so nice to keep up the coat like that every day and it just be so easy and nice. I hope it works. Um, I might try and do a, uh, a review on these. Would you guys like to see a review on these with my peppers? If so, if this video gets, let's say 20 likes, <laughs> 20 likes, I'll do it. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Bye! Have a great and wonderful day.